from my perspective, Stephen does check all the boxes. I mean, he's had an excellent professional career. Uh, he's made important technical impacts in his field. Um, he's given back in a big way, uh, especially to the Harper community, and we're so thankful for that. Well, he started his academic career here um, at Harper. Uh, he got a degree from here, and then he transferred to University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. He got his degree in electrical and computer engineering there. Uh, and after he finished there, he went to work as a software engineer. He has spent most of his career at a company called Vibes. He's currently their vice president of engineering. He's excellent technically, so he can take a really thorny and complicated technical issue and break it down and explain it to a non-technical person. I think that served him well professionally. Uh, he's an excellent communicator. Uh, very, very clear, there's no uh, misunderstanding the message that he's providing. Uh, he's a polymath, he takes on all these different interesting things and, and, and he excels at them. He has served as a volunteer firefighter in EMT for many, many years and actually uh, he took EMT courses here while he was at Harvard. I was recently talking to him about, uh, about colleges. So his son is a senior in high school uh, and they're planning college visits. And one of the visits is going to be to Iowa State University which is about a six hour drive from here. So Steven, and he's the only person I know who, who would do something like this, uh, he decided to rent an airplane and fly to, to, uh, <laughs> to Ames, Iowa, rather than take the long, boring drive. And so I learned in that exchange that on top of all these other cool things, he's a licensed pilot. So I mean, real Renaissance man. He comes back every year, he serves as a guest speaker for our introduction to engineering class, it's our EGRM 100 class. He'll speak to more than 100 of our students, so over the past six years, he's impacted hundreds and hundreds of Harper students. And his presentation is unique because he doesn't really spend a lot of time talking about himself. He spends most of the time providing advice to students who are interested in going into the software field. Uh, and he, he also intentionally uh, devotes some time to the history of the computer science field and he shares with our students the important role that women played in the early history of that field. And we have heard back from several of our women students who have, who have found that inspirational and motivating and allows them to continue even though it's, it's kind of a male dominated field now. He's also been really generous in volunteering his time uh, to visit uh, middle schoolers, uh, Chicago Public Schools, particularly for students from disadvantaged groups for a program called Hour of Code uh, where he introduces them to computer programming. And so that's why a volunteer program like that is so valuable because it lets students know, hey, I'm good at this, I can do this. So Stephen, congratulations on the Distinguished uh, Alumnus Award. Um, you're definitely a deserving candidate. Uh, I will tell you that as part of my 10 years at Harper, uh, one of the best parts of my job uh, is meeting with really, really impressive Harper faculty and you are really among the, among the, the best and truly impressive uh, of those faculty. So thank you for everything you do and you continue to do for the Harper community.